Alright, so in this tutorial, I'd like to answer a question that's been asked by a number of our customers in the past. And what they say is, great, so I've made this really cool shot now, but we actually offer three different flavors of our product. So what I'd like to have is the two back bottles with different labels and different color lids. So let's say that one should be red and that one should be blue. How do I go about that? And typically what people try to do is try to duplicate this bottle here. But the problem is that it's just an instance of the first bottle and all of the code within it is still referring to the product designer effect that's sitting within this comp. So if I change anything there, it will make changes to both of the bottles and that's just not going to work. So the correct approach to create a variation of your product is to go back to your product folder and create a copy of your product here and call it, say in this case, red. So now I open up my red bottle and I'm not gonna save any changes. And now I navigate to my product designer effect and I can change its lid color to red. And now the only thing that you need to pay attention here is to change the name of this effect. Because if we don't, then when we import this into our product shots comp, we're gonna have two products that are both referring to an effect called pill bottle designer. And their code is going to clash and what's gonna happen is that this new bottle will take on the look of the first bottle. So I'm going to call this red. And something else I'd advise to do is to rename the product designer comp so it's easier to differentiate between them if you're making any changes afterwards. And I'm also gonna rename this pill bottle to also red. Now I can save this and I can reopen my product shots uh, project file. So now I can import my red pill bottle and there it is and here's my red pill bottle sitting within the product folder now I can take one of the black guys and swap it out with a new bottle while holding the alt or the option key on my keyboard and replacing it like that and there you go I have my red bottle added to the comp now, if I go to its designer comp, I can go to its controls, change its lid to say uh, flip top, change the bottle's height to say 90%. And if I go back to my product shot, I can see that that bottle has updated. And we can scroll through it here. And I can also go to its label and I can give this guy a, a red tint effect to illustrate a, a different label. And then in my product shot, I can see that this label has also updated. So if you wanted to make a blue bottle variation, you just follow the exact same process where you duplicate this guy, rename it as blue, Change its design and you just need to make sure to change its controls layer effect name to blue and you should be good to go. All right, and that's more or less the process of creating additional variations of your products. And if you have any questions, just shoot us an email or, or leave a comment in the comment section below.